Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to Feed the Beast, myself, Lewis, I hope you're all good. And, you know, I've been listening to your comments on the quarry that we've been making, and, you know, I agree. I wholeheartedly, definitely agree that redstone engines are not going to do the job. <clears throat> you know, I got them all running, up and running, started them all up, and that, that little blob there, that took so goddamn long, horribly long, that all these little bad boys down here had time to grow. So, uh, yeah, that's uh, definitely not happening. And I got a bit of a sore throat at the minute, so bear with me. <clears throat> but, you know, I've been looking at different ways of how we can power the stuff. And I think the best way is going to be sterling engines. So these seem pretty boss. And they're not actually that expensive. So, yeah. Now, we got a tree in the last one as well. So we're going to uh, just pop this down and uh, make some bone meal. There we go. <clears throat> There we go, one lucky little tree, one lucky little tree, and we're going to nip these down and see if we can get a um, some saplings, because the sterling engine, as far as I'm aware, runs off wood, I think, so we're going to use that to actually use it, and so far, no sapler bobs, which is a bit annoying. Come on, just one, one sapler bob. It's not really that hard, is it, just to give me a sapling. <laughs> Oh yeah, I want to give. I want to try something out today as well. <clears throat> With this episode coming out, I've been looking on YouTube and for some reason. Only two episodes are ever in the uh, YouTube search, which makes it very hard for these episodes to get noticed for other amazing uh, Feed the Beast fans to come and see my work. And that's a bit annoying, so I can't figure out whether it's to do with uh, it needs more likes on it or whatnot, because apparently all that sort of stuff really helps with YouTube, and I'm not 100% sold on that, but apparently it does, and comments and all that. So what we're going to try is uh, I need as many as you uh, lovely, lovely people. Oh, some more. oh my god, they're all coming out now. I need you lovely guys to make sure you give it a thumbs up, pretty please. This is going to be our little experiment. And uh, it's only going to be on this video, so uh, don't feel like I'm pressuring you into anything. Just throw a thumbs up on this video and leave a comment. And a comment of whatever the hell you like. Could be your favourite cheese. Um, it could be uh, what you did on Saturday night or something. Or, uh, uh, I don't know, uh, did, did you watch X Factor? <laughs> I have no idea. But leave something on there, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to give it a few days. Oh, there goes my sword. I'm going to give it a few days, and uh, then we're going to come back and see if it's made its way up into the uh, search results for Feed the Beast. So, so because I, I think it's either that, or it's that I'm not putting enough... Um, Oh God, I've got loads of saplings out of this one. I'm not putting any titles to the videos because at the minute I'm just putting this like episode one or episode two, and I don't know whether YouTube can filter those ones out properly. So give that a go for me. Thank you very much, Lee. And we will then check it out, look at the statistics of how well it's doing. And if it comes up in the search results, then that's great because then I know what I need. I don't have to mess around with the video titles. But if the if it doesn't come up, then I'm gonna guess it's the video titles. And then what we'll do on the next one is I'll name it something. So uh, like uh, having fun with carrots or something. <laughs> and uh, then we will actually try and um, see if that makes its way in there without loads of likes and comments because I want to see what what's working here why isn't it working because at the minute I can only find two in there and we've done a lot of episodes and the two that aren't that are in there aren't even the most popular ones so yeah bit bit weird just a little bit weird now let's actually get on with what we're doing so I want to go grab the other engines the uh, redstone ones because we have our own crafting table I'm pretty sure the sterling engines need pistons as well so we're going to use these uncraft them so we can get the pistons out of them and then we're going to uh, create some sterling ones, which I think is a brilliant idea. And we need the uh, wood from these trees as well, because we need something to power the sterling engines. So we're going to take this wood, and then we can turn it into plankage, and then we can use it in the sterling engines. If they take a different type of power source as well, let me know, and uh, we'll change onto that. But I've only tested them once, and they used uh, wood. Well, that's, all right. that's the only thing I could find that they, they worked with. So, uh, yeah, there we go. So let's take all those. 40 woods. I'm pretty sure they run really fast as well. I don't know if they have a chance of overheating, so uh, if any of you played around with it, then uh, let me know. Because you guys have got to remember that the only stuff I played with is the stuff that's in Tekkit, and um, I haven't, I didn't touch all the stuff in that as well. There's a few bits I missed, so yeah, Sterling engines. Um, I don't really understand them that greatly. So let's undo these. There we go. Take all of this good stuff. Ow! Can only do like loads at a time. Hold on, why is it? 
Did I just duplicate those? Insane. Insane in the membrane. I don't know how the hell I did that. All right, there we go. That's two. For, for, oh my god, look how much stuff I've got out of this. Huh, amazing. I don't know how that worked. And one. Is that it? Yeah, yeah. There we go. There we go. So I got four out of that with three things. So I think there could be some sort of bug there or something going on. But I'm not going to complain. I ain't going to moan about that. All right, we got our bits. Now we need to work out Sterling. I oh, don't know, that's not it. Is they even called Sterling Engines? Is that the name of them? I'm not sure. I found them by doing this before. Stir. Oh, what an I. Okay, right, fair enough. So, pistons, glass, and cobblestone with stone gears. Okay, right, so we need to upgrade our gears. So let's grab some cobbly stone and upgrade our gears. And I don't really know how many of these we need, so I'm going to try making two. I would say, yeah, two. So we need four, four gears. Uh, that's a bit too many in there, too many there again. It's fine, it's fine. There we go, oh, no. All right, let's take all those, and then, uh, all right, we got four of those. We got pistons, we got cobblestone, and we got glass. So this should be enough to make them. So let's uh, do this. So one, three, four, and then two. Two and two, yep, yep, I oh, need two of those, don't we? The glass, and then coal stone. Pow, sterling engines. And they will get powered by redstone torches, so it's fine. It's all good. So now we've done that, we need to actually, um, we need to tunnel it down, pipe it down into the good place. And I was thinking that that's got quite a lot of gubbins in it, hasn't it? So, you know, we could have it coming straight down here, but it's going to connect into this chest, which isn't really what I want. But there isn't tons in there, is there? There's not tons. Let's knock one side away. And then we can put a different chest on it. So let's throw this stuff in here. Oh, I've actually got tons of it already. All right, we'll throw some of it in here. And that's, uh, that's going to be good. We'll take that chest because I've got a plan. I'm a man with a plan. And you guys are the ones that recommended me to this anyway. So, uh, yeah, well done. Applause to you. So we're going to upgrade the chest so we can hold more in it. So that way I haven't got to keep going backwards and forwards continuously to get it all right. So what have we got? So regular chest is uh, iron chest. So let's, let's make an iron chest first. And uh, have I got any iron on me? Pretty sure I have. It's normally in my uh, bits and bobs. Here we go. Iron. There we go. So we have to fill this with iron. So let's throw it all around. This should make a iron chest. And then we want to make a gold chest, like a boss. Uh, where's my gold? Gold. There we go. One gold chest. Okay. Right. Gold chest done. Diamond chest, it's two diamonds and glass, so that's fine. It's not a massive waste on diamonds, because we should get them back from doing all this. And uh, glass. Uh, where's my glass? Glass. Ah, oh, there you are. Cool beans. So, how did this one look again? Gold chest, diamonds, glass. Okay, right. Gold chest, diamonds, Ooh. and glass. There we go. Diamond chest. Copper chest, silver chest, so crystal chest, insane! All right, so this is the next one up. So crystal chest. Oh, we haven't got a glass on us. I got any glass? Uh, five, five. I uh, you don't think we have enough, but I can quickly go and make some. It's not the end of the world. I'm sure we've got some sand. There we go. And have any of these got any? Uh, there we go. Oh man, I've got loads of iron as well. Good times. Right. Let's make one of these. Then we'll have enough glass to make one of these uh, crystal chests, which is just diamonds of glass. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We need eight bits of glass. So, there we go. Great six things. And I'm going to go put all the rest of my uh, bits in here so we don't lose any of it. There we go. And have we actually got any more wood? I don't know if I've got any more wood, but I do need some... Uh, we're going to need a little bit more glass, actually, because I need to make some pipes, don't I? So, yeah, we'll take that wood. And, yeah, we're going to need to make 
quite a bit of glass, so let's take this. Then we can at least make one of these chests. So, here we go. So this should make a, uh, a crystal chest. Insane. Now, these pipes are going to come down here. And can I put that there? Yes, I can. So they'll come through there and then into that chest, which sounds good. Great success. And they can just go anywhere into it, so they're probably just going to go into the side of it, I think. And then all the bits will pop in there. Oh my god, it's so horrible outside. It's disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. And uh, we need to make some uh, cobblestone pipes as well. Uh, just regular pipes, which is just uh, glass with cobble on the sides. So uh, let's grab some cobblestone, some glass, and uh, make some of these. So like that. And that. There we go, 32. And I'm pretty sure I've already got some in here. Cobblestone. Cobblestone. There we go. Now, I was thinking for a live stream that we're going to do soon, because I actually haven't live streamed in ages. I was thinking what we could do, which sounds insane in the membrane to me, is we're going to spend a live stream basically uh, doing up the central command. I was thinking we could do that, because I think that's a brilliant idea, and we can see what we can get out of the central command center. I was thinking we could have a cool roof, and, uh, you know, we could make some bits, like a, like a, like a, uh, kitchen probably kitchen yeah we'll make a kitchen and then i want to make i keep saying this but eventually we're gonna do it i want to make an automated chicken farm that actually burns the chickens for me now i watched a really good one on monkey farms so if any of you watch monkey farm go check him out because i give him all the credit for this idea he made a really cool chicken cooker uh, but I, I want to use tech it with it. Well, not tech it, but I want to use feed the beast with it. So I'm designing a way so that we use all the feed the beast of it so it's even easier and looks even cooler. Because, you know, if you're making all this cool gizmos, it looks goddamn cool, doesn't it? Don't get me wrong. You know, I know where you guys are playing this. It's purely because it's not because you can do all this magic crap. It's because it looks insane. It looks mental. And that's, that's why you're doing it. So we're going to get on that and we're going to make the most amazing chicken farm ever. And it's, it's going to look insane. And I was thinking, you know, we could do it online live. Because it's not really uh, showing off any items, is it? It's just building something. Which is not normally what I do on camera. But live, it could be fun. It could be fun. So, uh, yeah. There we go. Now, oh my god, it's pissing it down out here. Have we got our engines on us? Because this is going uh, to be horrible. There we go, right. Oh, oh, it's disgusting out here. I haven't even got a sword. If I get attacked, I'm buggered. Let's go grab a sword. I'm pretty sure I can chucked a sword in here. We got a golden sword, but they go really easily. I had a uh, iron sword earlier. What have I done with that? There we go. One iron sword. Um, let's move these over here. Lagly. Okay, right. Oh my god, skellywags everywhere. Dude, ow. Ow. No need. No need. Right. Go to hell. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Right, let's hurry up and do this. Ugh. Right. Almost there. Ah! Monsters! Evil things! Spawn of Satan! And this is going to come through my nightlight. What are those blue things? Oh. I'm just so wary of creepers at the minute. The amount of times I come out and I get creep it up. Ah, oh, creep it up, ting. Alright, let's get inside the command center. Ooh. Oh, it's disgusting out there. And uh, let's fit this up. Boom ting! There we go, straight into the chest. Now let's fit our engines onto it. Yeah, guys, definitely tell me whether these bad boys can explode because uh, <laughs> that could be a fail and a half. That could be fun. All right, let's fit this up, and then we're uh, we're good. We're good. Standing engines. One there. One there. Wood. With and redstone. Do your thing! Jesus Christ, look how quick that's going. That's amazing. Do these burn up quick though?
I don't know. Kind of quick. Like, that's already on 19, so I guess you'd have to keep planting, wouldn't you? We're going to need to make, like, a uh, automated woodcutting facility as well, which would be pretty interesting. But, you know, at least it's starting. It's a start, isn't it? Alright. Alright. Okay, right, let's get back to the command centre. At least we've got automation on the go, which is always a good start, isn't it? <laughs> Eventually I'm going to have steps, which would be nice. Oh, look at that. Okay, guys, right, we're going to leave this one here. Uh, that's Feed the Beast, and I will see you soon for another episode. Don't forget what we said at the beginning. Give it a like and a comment of your choice, whatever the hell you want to put, like your favourite fish. Uh, there's an Enderman behind me. Oh, oh no, maybe not. <laughs> I hate this place. Right, yeah, give it a like and uh, your favourite comment of the day, or whatever the hell you want to put, and we'll do a little experiment, and uh, I'd really appreciate it, guys, if you can get involved. So I will see you soon for another episode. Have a good one, and goodbye.